Hey, thanks for joining us for our day five coverage of Browns training camp. We're joined by our good friend Daryl Ryder from 92.3 The Fan. Daryl, what did we see out of the uh, Browns today? A lot of talk about Terrell Pryor. Yeah, Terrell Pryor got dinged up, a little hamstring injury. He told us after practice, doesn't think it's going to be much of a big deal uh, right now. Mike Pettin said they are going to examine and make sure everything's okay. Also, Malcolm Johnson, the fullback, the rookie fullback, he got dinged up. They're really beat up right now in the backfield, Andy. Daryl, as we uh, talk about camp today, a couple veterans, Joe Hayden had the day off today, and we, we were concerned concerned about the running back situation because they had to bring in two more yesterday. But as far as the veterans are concerned, Mike Patton's been handing, handling this camp uh, to a T. Yeah, he has. And uh, this is something that he did last year. He's doing it again this year. As you mentioned, Andy, Joe Hayden got the day off. Carlos Dansby got the day off. A couple other guys were off as well. And it opens the doors for some of these other players. Pierre Desir is really jumping out here in this camp. He is ahead of Justin Gilbert. Remember, Gilbert taken with the eighth overall pick. And it shows you that the Browns, they don't play favorites uh, with guys. They are based completely on their performance. And right now, Desir is having himself a good camp. He was with the ones once again in 11 on 11. All right, Daryl, let's size up the quarterbacks on day five. Uh, well, uh, so far, so good, I think, at that position. I, look, we're seeing some of the mobility from both of these guys. We all know what Johnny can do as far as getting out of the pocket. But Josh McCown, we've seen a couple of scrambles. Josh threaded a couple of nice footballs again today. The but you get to see this defense as well. And there are a couple of passes that get got knocked away uh, that I thought were pretty well thrown. But you, you have players making plays. But all in all, I think Josh McCown is having himself a pretty good camp. He has yet, knock on wood, he has yet to throw an interception in team drills. All right, that's Daryl Ryder. I'm Andy Baskin, continuing coverage on News Channel 5 and Newsnet 5. Thanks for watching.